Booyah! Hey, what's up? This is Cuz from VR Gadget. This is kind of a two-in-one video. I'm going to show you real quick this gun accessory by Mad Cats, and I'm going to show you the shoot demo. So this is actually a really simple, light little gun accessory here. On the right side, it has a start button. Left side, select. Um, it's you know it's really light. It's not really am amazing or anything. There's a lot of different models. So here's kind of the trigger mechanism. Um, it's kind of this, uh, lever system there. So you pull the trigger and. Um, it therefore pulls the trigger on the move, slides right in, fits like a glove, snap that top, and bam. Now you can play the shoot, and this is how it should be played. I also use that gun on mag, um, and that helps. Basically, I wouldn't use a shooting game without that accessory. It's just kind of awkward holding it like um, kind of like a lightsaber or something, pointing it at the screen. So, All right, let's get into the shoot here. Um, by the way, it's a great game. Alright, so now you've seen that gun accessory. Let's get into the shoot. I like this. I, I noticed, I think IGN wasn't too high on it, but um, I enjoyed playing this. I'd mix it in every once in a while, maybe to go trophy hunting or something. It's also worthy to consider multiplayer, which I didn't um, test. So this is, this is your Hogan's Alley, 22 years later from the NES for any classic game appreciators um, as I mentioned in the video I wouldn't play this without the gun I just don't think it'd be quite as fun so a couple things you, uh, one of the number one keys is this game is about rhythm accuracy obviously is important but you'll gain accuracy by gaining rhythm so slow is fast fast is slow pop 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 that's kind of the, the speed that works right and I had mixed success I didn't keep on practicing so another thing to consider is the terrain like use it obviously I'm exploding all kinds of stuff right there that guy had dynamite but you can also shoot the TNT crates this is little final boss and I'm sure I'll get a comment on it or two uh, total fail right I, I I don't know how to pick these three dudes off so whatever you know they cut the scene and we just keep it pumping so you notice a few times there I was using special moves and that's definitely something you want to take advantage of. I noticed when I was playing I had like you know 10 show times built up or something and then you realize you should be cranking them out. I'm not sure if there's a refresh wait period or not but you definitely want to remember to use that stuff. Um, again with you know you'll find you might get moving kind of tense you know when you start playing this game so make sure you kind of keep your shoulders relaxed stay relaxed and you'll actually do better but the number one key is rhythm and I mean this is not rock band I, I just mean you know nice and smooth because you do have time to take the bad guys down speaking of special moves here's a rampage that I just earned from shooting accurately and I don't think I use it very well right here I think that it allows you to just rapid fire without even worrying about missing and it, it just builds up your multiplier because remember I mean that's the big deal this is about multipliers so one shot one hit and keep it going boom 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 so I like this game at the end of it you'll see kind of see the score from the round so I'm not gonna narrate the rest of it but that is the shoot I, I would just definitely assume that they will have more shooting based games out so maybe if you're not feeling it you don't have to race this maybe there'll be another style but you know I think there's a lot of people out there that do like that you know pistol style shooter or maybe even they'll come out with some kind of longer weapon so thanks for watching and yes I did not do very well on this boss either but I have popped him before so Oh yeah, so the final thing here is um, this game, y the demo's at the PlayStation Network, so just go download it, you know, and test it out yourself. And if you're feeling it, purchase it. So, later. Booyah!